Flags up. Here's Mark. And they're off. They race over the extended two and a half miles in the Coral Racing Club Join for Free Handicap Chase. They make the run towards the first of the 16 fences. And Pepe Lamocco, the short price favourite at the moment, just dropping in to around about fourth position with on the inside Captain Martin landing in front, out quite wide, Le Legirien, and wider still to Red Rookie, then Pepe Lamocco. The back marker is Toki Doki as they go over fence number two. On now towards the open ditch, and it is Cap de Martin who has got the lead with out wide Le Legirien racing in second as they go over this ditch. In third, the stripes of Pepe Lamocco, followed by Red Rookie and Toki Doki. On now towards the fourth, and Cap de Martin's lead is about a length or so, although he was closed down towards the outside by Le Legirien, who took it in second. Length and a half back to Red Rookie now in third against the rail, Pepe Lamocco, and a couple of lengths to Toki Doki. So now on the turn, bringing them into the home straight for the first time, and on now to fence number five. And it is Harry Cobden and Cap de Martin by just over a length and a half to the previous course and distance winner, Le Legirien, racing in second. His victory coming here in November. Then on the inside is Pepe Lamocco, who's already won this season at Warwick as they go over the first in the home straight. Red rookie, last but one, and Toki Doki is the back marker. On now towards fence number six, Cap de Martin has the lead. Cap de Martin, but by only a neck or so to Le Legirien, who took it in second. At the back of the field, Toki Doki was just nudged away from that fence. And now they come up towards the enclosures and fence seven, the last in a circuit's time. Cap de Martin jumps it well, much better than Le Legirien towards the near side. A break of about two and a half back to Pepe Lomoco in third. Red rookie alongside and a further break of three lengths to Toki Doki. Into the turn and on now towards the two fences on the side of the course, fences eight and nine. Cap de Martin leads the way. It's the wide racing Le Legirien racing in second. Between those two is Red Rookie with on the inside Pepe Lamocco and saw that break of three lengths to Toki Doki on his second run after a long break. On then towards fence number eight and Cap de Martin and Le Legirien in the air together. Here there was about a neck between them. A couple of lengths back to Red Rookie on the outside of Pepe Lamocco and they go now towards a ditch which is the ninth and Le Legirien moves right up on the outside of Cap de Martin but not for the first time. Le Legirien landed rather hind legs first and again he hands the advantage to Cap de Martin. Now a long run before they cross over fence number 10. They've nearly completed the circuit. Cap de Martin leads the way to Le Legirien in second. Pepe Lamocco in the slipstream of the leader. On that one's outside, Red Rookie. And just over two lengths back to Toki Doki. No more than about five lengths off the leader, who continues to be Cap de Martin as he sets off down the backstroke for the second time. And this is the seventh from home. Cap de Martin over this fence, again with a share of the lead, but more fluent than Le Legirien, who's had this tendency to trial his hind legs through the fences. Red Rookie now travels up between them to press for the lead as they go over six out. And again, another mistake by Le Legirien. He's jumping, he's letting him down, and Pepe Lamocco in fourth, the short price favourite, just niggled away from that fence by David Noonan. Final ditch is five out, new leader. Red Rookie comes to it. He just came down on the top of the fence, and he hands the advantage to Le Legirien. Now Cap de Martin's back to third, and then Pepe Lamocco closing up. Four out. Le Legirien led by two to Red Rookie in second. Pepe Lamocco now in third. Cap de Martin may well have run his race. He's about to be passed now by Toki Doki, who tries to get involved. And now they're on the turn back towards home with three fences to jump. And it's Tom Cannon and Le Legirien out in front to Pepe Lamocco. There's about two and a half lengths between them. A further three back to Red Rookie and then Toki Doki and Cap de Martin, who's now tailing off last of the five. In line for home and down towards a third from home. Le Legirien has the lead as he jumps this fence. He jumped that one okay. He leads by a length and a half to Pepe Lamocco in second. Toki Doki has now stayed on into third. Red Rookie's held now in fourth and they're coming down towards the second last. Le, Le Girien over on the far side. His lead only half a length to Pepe Lamocco who now is coming alongside, goes by and takes the 
lead and goes clear by two lengths on the run down towards the final fence. Pepe Lamocco at the last and over safely. Clear of a blundering Le Legerien in second place. Tokidoki is in third and up towards the line it will be Pepe Lamocco who wins. Le Legerien will be second. Tokidoki will be third. Red Rookie in fourth and pulling up before two out was Captain Matin. Well, in the end, Pepe Lamocco has won as the market rather suggested he might with his head in his chest, six to five on by many, many lengths. Uh, that mark of 119 will be...